What's up, y'all? We just signed Bobby Wagner. Did, did you hear me? We just signed Bobby Wagner to an $8 million one-year deal. I understand his age, but he still got it. My man was 33, putting up 180 tackles. At 33, I don't know who he's trying to be or how long he planned on playing, but he's the closest thing we have to a Ray Lewis in the flesh. He's the closest. I don't care what nobody say. He's the closest. He's been to nine Pro Bowls, and he's won a Super Bowl. And He's been at the top of the league three times with the most tackles in the league, just like Ray Lewis. He's won a Super Bowl just like Ray Lewis. Ray Lewis won two. Ray Lewis played up until he was 37. I don't know if he's going to play up to 37. But Bobby Wagner, to have anybody at the middle linebacker position, the person that's going to be controlling everything, I would want Bobby Wagner. Like, this is the best pick. I don't care how old he is. He has not dropped. His his production has been beautiful. His production has been the same. And it's not and honestly, not even the same. It's been going up every year. So it's like, bruh, he has not dropped off no matter where he has gone. Everywhere he has gone, Seahawks, the Rams, now us. I pray he don't drop off. I'm just like if anybody was at the middle of our, our defense, I'm glad it's him. I think this is one of the greatest French, I mean, free agent picks we've had in a very long time. Like, his age does not mean nothing right now. Like, I don't even care that he's 33 and about to be 34 before the season starts. That has nothing to do with anything. Bruh, it's Bobby Wagner. Who wouldn't go get Bobby? Especially if you know you needed him. And your team is weak on defense, bruh. That just solves everything. You feel me? Like, and I think last season we wanted to get him, but he wanted to go back to the Seahawks because it was he said that he wanted to retire as a Seahawk. And um we understand that wasn't possible right now. Um it may be possible if he continues to keep playing. But um maybe at the end of this year he might decide to go back to the Seahawks again. Just like he did when he was with the LA Rams and they wanted him back. But man, um, this is a wonderful pick, man. Um, I never thought we would have got Bobby Wagner out of all players in the league. But don't get me wrong, I was happy about the Frankie Louvu uh franchise pick. I mean a franchise pick, free agency pick. But this is even better. This guy has been to nine Pro Bowls. Can we can we put that into perspective? Who have we had that has gone to Pro Bowls at the linebacker position in the last year, in the last two years, in the last three? Thank you. Like, bruh, I'm just so happy that we got Bobby Wagner. I, I don't understand. I, I, don't, I don't think you understand. I don't think people understand what this does for us. And not only is he here, but we got him here with his people. The people that helped him win a Super Bowl, Ken Norton Jr., the linebackers coach, and Dan Quinn, our head coach, helped in that process of him winning the Super Bowl. And at that time, Dan Quinn was a defensive coordinator. And he was phenomenal. He was phenomenal then. He's phenomenal now. And then at that time when he played with the Seahawks, he was with the Legion of Boom. We talking, we talking the reckless of the reckless. We talking the people that was knocking people out left and right. I wouldn't want to play them even on the game. It was dangerous. And all I'm saying is I'm just happy for this pick. This is the best pick we've made this year in free agency. And we made this pick on what? I think day three? On day three. I'm surprised he, he stayed there that long. I'm just happy, man. And, and uh, um... I'm just excited, man, and I'm just, I think Adam Peters is doing a wonderful job, and I'm looking at what he's doing, and of course, I don't agree with every pick. Like I said before, 
I felt like we could should have kept Antonio Gibson. I felt like we should have re-signed Curtis Samuel. Of course, I don't agree with every one of them. But this one, I agree with. I do. And I think we should get Tyron Smith. I still haven't seen any news on Tyron. But I'm ready to see if we get him. Let's get him. I'm, I'm excited. Put him on the team. But, man, I, I think this is a great thing to have on our defense, man. We definitely needed this. And um, I'm not sure what type of defense we about to be playing. But I'm telling you, we about to be hitting. And if you want anybody on your defense, it's Bobby Wagner. He knows how to keep a defense together. He knows how to talk, hype him up. He, like I said before, he's the closest thing to a Ray Lewis we have in the flesh. And this team, with Bobby Wagner there right now, we have potential. We have a lot of potential to make it to the playoffs. It just depends on our offense and what they do in, 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 the, in the draft. And I'm out.